Hello, everyone, and welcome back to another video brought to you by SeniorCatWellness.com. In today's material, we'll discuss the topic of eggs and felines and whether it's safe to feed your cat or cat's eggs. But before we make an omelet, let's first take a look at today's topic overview. Eggs can be fed to cats, but they must be cooked. Raw eggs contain avidin, a protein that prevents biotin from being absorbed into the cat's body. Raw eggs can contain salmonella, but cooking the eggs kills this bacteria and neutralizes the avidin. Eggs should be boiled or poached, disheveled, and broken into bite-sized pieces. Right out of the gate, it simply cannot be stressed enough. No raw eggs. Don't even consider it. This amounts to us eating raw meat. It's a no-go for the reasons noted in our topic overview. Eggs must be cooked. That is imperative. And regardless of how you serve up cooked eggs to your cat, it's also critical to cut the eggs up into small pieces, and it's also very important to avoid seasonings. While raw eggs are not an option, even cooked eggs that contain salt, pepper, garlic, onions, cheese, well, you name it, they should also be off limits. And yes, we did say cheese. All dairy products can promote gastrointestinal distress. Keep things simple in terms of the serving size and the actual size of the cooked egg pieces, while also keeping everything as natural as possible. And before we journey on with today's first subsection, we'd like to thank you for taking this journey with us. Whether this is your very first video or you've been here from the start, you are family to us. You are the heartbeat of Senior Cat Wellness, as these videos are absolutely nothing without you. Viewers make the world turn when it comes to material like this. And we are very appreciative, and we thank you so much for your support and for joining us today. Thank you for taking a few minutes out of your busy day to be right here. We hope you do find this content to be both informative and enjoyable, and we do hope to see you again down the road. Now, cats and eggs. Let's get things cooking, shall we? Since cooked eggs are indeed the way to go, and in this case, the only way to go. Let's discuss the benefits of cooked eggs. Well, eggs are a wonderful source of both protein and amino acids for cats. Eggs also contain vitamins A, B, D, E, and K, not to mention thiamine, iron, zinc, selenium, and riboflavin. In moderation, which is very critical, cooked eggs can actually be quite beneficial to your cat. Additionally, eggs are a bit fatty, this can be good if you're trying to aid your feline in adding a small amount of weight. As a word of caution, we should note that some cats can be allergic to eggs. This is yet another reason why moderation is indeed so critical. Start with a tiny amount and monitor your cat for any negative side effects, such as diarrhea, vomiting, and or skin irritation. If no symptoms have appeared within the course of five to seven days after consumption, then your cat is in the clear and you can feed your pet cooked eggs with no extra additives in small and responsible amounts as a treat. And when we say cooked, we do mean cooked. No runny yolks. The composition of an eggshell <laughs> goes a little something like this. 95% calcium carbonate and 5% serving as a mixture of proteins. This is why crushed eggshells, and essentially what amounts to eggshell powder, can be consumed by your cat. While calcium is a critical part of a cat's diet, crushing eggshells into powder doesn't sound like a enjoyable task. <laughs> I'll just be I'll just be totally 100% real about that. That doesn't sound very inviting. However, if you do decide to press on in this manner, it becomes critical that the shells are reduced to that of a powder in an effort to eliminate a choking hazard, which is obviously very serious. In terms of the actual consumption, the powder itself is meant to be used as an additive. Sprinkle the powder over your cat's existing food or perhaps even the egg that you have prepared. Half a teaspoon, half a teaspoon and no more. That is the recommendation. Before you consider eggshell crushing and everything that it entails, please contact the vet. We do advise it and ask about the proper ways to achieve this objective in a responsible way 
and also ask about shell consumption frequency. Felines are obligate carnivores that live on that meat parade. For this reason, cats do not need eggs. Having said that, they can be served as a nice treat. The protein and amino acids that eggs provide can be quite useful. While eggs should never be used as a meal replacement, they can be a nice change of pace. And here again, just like anything, responsibility coupled with moderation is the goal and it is the key. No raw eggs and no seasonings. Hard boiled, poached, or scrambled, that is the ticket. Everything should be served up in those tiny pieces. You can either let the egg stand on its own or add it to existing cat food. And about that egg shell crushing for calcium, give the professionals a ring. Contact your vet before attempting. And on that note, is anyone else hungry for eggs or is it just me? <laughs> Anybody else want a boiled egg? Sounds great right about now. I don't know about you. On that note, that will indeed close things out for the video portion of today's presentation. However, if you'd like more information concerning this very interesting and somewhat unique topic, we do invite you to visit us at SeniorCatWellness.com at the conclusion of today's presentation. There you will find a full-length and highly detailed article dedicated to everything we've talked about here today and so much more. Are you currently watching us off-site? If so, we encourage you to click the initial link in the description box below. Said link will take you to all of the information. And until our paths cross again, and I certainly hope they do, we'd like to thank you once again for joining us today. Please have a wonderful day. All the best to you and yours, and we will talk to you later.